the stats every minute this week. I'm doing my part, I'm paying attention, and I play my position. It's Crypto Lightsaber back with another video, guys. And today we're going to talk about Titan X. Um, it's my first video covering this project. Um, I, want, I want to talk about why I think that you should have at least some Titan X in your portfolio. I did invest in this a short while back. We'll take a look at what I did in this project. Not gone as big as some other people, but I do think it's wise to have some skin in the game on this particular project. Okay, guys. So Titan X for me, I feel like, you know, this is giving me like, you know, there's a lot of old school hexagons and DeFi OGs really bullish on this project as well as some larger influences we'll take at one uh, a look at one of them in just a few minutes okay guys but I think it was wise for me to you know at least get some dibs in on this early not as early as some others I think I didn't even know about this project for like a month and um, you know I did feel like I was late uh, to start with so I didn't pull the trigger straight away but by the time I got into this, I still managed to get myself a good T rank bonus. Um, um, you know, at the end of the day, I, I I could have done better. I could have gotten sooner, but I didn't. Um, but ultimately, um, you know, everyone's got their own strategy. Everyone's got their own thought process when it comes to crypto. Um, the problem that I had in the beginning with Titan X is the for the simple fact that we've seen it before with things like Zen. Okay, guys, mining Zen. Um, I got completely wrecked on Zen. Okay, um, I have a bunch of Zen FTs and Zen uh, stakes or um, what was it, mints that I didn't even actually claim because at the time it's like the gas fee is more than the actual claim. Okay, so Zen did put me off a little bit. Um, and, you know, we're not talking about long term future or potential of Zen, but Zen, they there was a lot of hype at the beginning. Uh, they did some things right and some things were probably done a little bit wrong or some people had the edge because they were a little bit more you know um tech savvy and you know were minting loads of wallets uh, at the beginning with bots and all that sort of stuff i didn't know how to do all that sort of stuff so you know i the only way i made money on zen is by trading zen basically buying the lows which was super risky waiting for a pump taking profits or whatever Okay, guys, but mining didn't go too well for me with Zen. Uh, with Titan X, I'm a little bit more hopeful, or, or should I say I'm a lot more hopeful for this simple fact that something like Titan X can learn from the mistakes of Zen. And, um, you know, a lot more people were bullish on it. And, um, you know, it's got a lot of hex vibes. Okay, guys, in my opinion. Um, and, you know, it's something new. Um, timing is everything as well. So I think, I think that this launched at the right time as well. Um, Zen probably launched at the wrong time, but um, it's arguable, okay? But anyway, let's just talk about Titan X. So Titan X, I did create a few miners. I haven't gone crazy. My dashboard doesn't look like I've got 50 miners, okay? I've got three miners, which I did around November time, okay? So I did this in November. I thought, you know what? might as well take a risk and put something in here if i'm going to put something in might as well just do it and i just put something in i did three miners i did them for 90 to 100 days okay so no 20 day miners no 30 day miners just straight 90 to 100 days see where this is in three months okay guys and right now um at least we're still looking like we're going to be in a profit on this particular project um yeah i mean uh, this was a lot more at some point. I think this has gone down by about 60% um, from when I think this was around $30,000 I was expecting, which would have been an absolute incredible return. But, you know, ultimately, you know, I knew that wasn't going to be sustainable. And, you know, well, actually, actually, if we go to the chart, right? So, you know, uh, this could pump. This could pump, and the reason why I believe that it could and it might, for one, the community, okay, it has a bullish community, okay, and uh, people really love this project, okay, so people are buying this token, they're buying the lows, it came out with a bang at the beginning, it came all the way down, and I believe I invested around on these lows, okay, or at least I, I did buy the token, I did buy and sell the token as well, actually, okay, but in terms of the miners, right, um, I put in some of the profits into miners, okay? Um, so, yeah, I think I'm getting more tokens than what I actually had 
when I was uh, when when I actually bought the token just through the miners, right? Because obviously, you know, um, longer pays better and all that sort of stuff, right? But um, it is reaching the low, so for me, this could be the the bottom, okay? And um, what it is, there's further development going on. Other projects are going to be built on top of Titan X. Uh, the founder, uh, Jake Sharp, okay, he's building a project called Hyper, okay, guys. And a lot of people are gearing up for this launch. We don't know when it's going to be. But um, this is why I think the price could pump, okay? The price, and it probably will pump, okay? Um, we're not going to cover everything about Titanx in this video. We're just going to cover some of the things which makes me bullish on and why I titled the video out, you know, uh, what did I title the video? Well, you need to hold some Titanx. I, I believe that you should hold some Titanx, okay? There's going to be people mining it uh, and, and they're selling it, claiming they're miners, selling the titan x okay there's going to be people buying it and trading it but why i think that you know you should hold some is because this has hex potential okay guys because of all of the buying and burning that's coming all of the other protocols that be that are being built on top of it the fact that the mining difficulty gets harder okay so for example if i was to do 90 days now right uh, a 90 day miner at 100 max uh, uh power just like i did with these other ones right right now I'll be getting from $474, which it cost me a 0.2 ETH on each of these miners, okay? And um, even still, I'm getting around $3,000 on these miners. At one point, it was like $10,000, $9,000, $10,000, $11,000, uh, $12,000. But, you know, obviously, that's gone down because the price has gone down, okay? But the price comes back up, that goes back up. But um, right now, you are you still get a... Uh, over 90 days, you will still make a 3x, right? A 3 to 4x, but um, it's just not as much. So the mining difficulty gets lower as time goes by. So obviously, that's a good thing because it makes it harder to get the tokens through mining. If people want that same amount of tokens, they need to buy it. Okay, guys? So, you know, if you want more in a short space of time, you need to buy it. Uh, why people aren't going to be doing like the 20 to 30 day miners anymore is because 20 days, you'll be losing money. Okay, you might as well just buy the token at this point. 30 days, okay, you're literally making a couple of dollars, like $30, okay, $40. Okay, so it's not, there's no point. If the price goes down by 10%, obviously, you, you're not making a profit. Okay, guys, so now people have got no choice but to do longer, longer miners. Okay, if they want to double their money, they need to do for it, uh, for at least 60 days. All right, guys, so uh, for the people that came before that mind, yeah, a lot of those people will be taking profits because they're up massively, right, which makes sense. But obviously, there's going to be a lot of new people coming in. We are on day 71, all right, guys, so there's going to be a lot of new people coming into the project. And, um, you know, a lot of those people are going to say, yo, I need some Titan X because Hyper's coming in. The only way that you can get into Hyper is by burning some Titan X. So you need to have some Titan X. You can't afford to wait for your miners to, to, to be claimed because they're like 60 days away. So, uh, or, you know, by the time Titan X actually goes live, whenever that might be, obviously, the only way to get into Hyper at that point, if you don't already hold some liquid Titan X, is to buy some Titan X and burn it. To get into hyper because that's the only way you can get into hyper is by burning some titan x so that is obviously something that's going to be bullish for the price and um, just like we saw with zen zen came out it came down it hit the lows and then when the first project launched it was built on top of zen it might have been db zen or one of them right the price started to pump that hype came in it did like a 10 x okay guys so i believe that this could be, do a minimum 10 x once hyper comes out minimum but well potentially it's not financial advice all right, guys, but it could do something like that, okay? Especially because it's super low market cap, sitting at only a 6 million, okay? It's, it won't be much for this to go to a 60 million, 120 million, 10, 20x, okay? In my opinion, not financial advice, okay? Now, another thing, uh, let's just close this down. Uh, I was going to show you, uh, forget about Zen right now, okay? Uh, no, what are we doing? Okay, let's just close that. Okay, so... Uh, Joe Parry is a large influencer. He keeps talking about Zen. I keep seeing videos every single, every other day popping up about Zen. He's super bullish on Zen and probably heavily invested in Zen. Okay, guys. And he highlighted a bunch of other projects that are being built on top of Zen. Okay, one like Titan Blaze, for example. Um, he talked about uh, Hyper. 
okay? Uh, the founder is Jake Sharp. He talked about Hyper just being built on top of Zen. I do recommend you go and watch this video because he does cover a bunch of projects that are going to be uh, launching on top of uh, Zen. Uh, so, <laughs> Titan X, Titan X, okay, guys? So this is obviously going to be bullish for the uh, bullish for the price of Zen. It's got a community. It's got people that are building on top of it. People that want to see Zen burned. Okay, Titan Blaze, for example, more Zen is going to be burned just from this project. Okay, now whether the community gets behind these projects and backs them, that's a different thing. But I know one for certain is that Hyper is created by the same founder. So he's building the first uh, project on top of Titan X, uh, which is Hyper. And a lot of people I know for a fact, or at least I get that, uh feeling that people are going to be backing it okay uh, because they want these types of gains okay they want this they want these types of gains okay it will come out it will pump people will sell they'll they'll they'll, they'll take profits okay um and this for example did 32 uh 32 x on day one not sorry not day one yeah we're in the first couple of days okay guys and people want those fast gains at the end of the day and then i believe that 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 that, that hyper those hyper gains funnel straight back in or a lot of it straight back into titan x okay guys so that is the game theory or that's what i'm expecting on that okay guys um also right so on titan x obviously you have the where are we you have the buy and burn okay and a lot of people are making a lot of money on staking as well just from staking titan x so let me just put that out there as well but the buy and burn basically there's two it has the the v2 which is the fast release and the v1 which is the slow release okay so we have approximately 30 million dollars here okay and that's because you know that obviously the price of ethereum goes up that that becomes a lot more but there's around 30 million dollars that's going to go towards buying back the titan x token okay anyone can trigger this most of you watching this already know how this works okay that's actually increased actually to it's 3.3 eth it was one eth uh every eight minutes uh going to buy and burn okay is it 3.3 eth every eight minutes i'm not sure but um there's a lot of uh there's basically a lot of you know basically mechanics working in this project which would suggest that in time this is going to go to the moon so looking at the price right now um it doesn't really worry me okay uh, this was a flaw before it seems to be a flaw right now okay obviously there's going to be people that come in and trade it it goes up it goes down there's people that are mining it so obviously they're going to take profits but you know i see this going up um you know uh in the anticipation that hyper is going to make people a lot of money as well okay guys so this is why i believe that at least in this year you need to be holding some titan x at least for the time at least for when the first protocol launches on titan x and obviously a lot of people are talking like this could do a 10,000 x because hex did a 10,000 x you know guys even if this does a 1,000 x even if this does a 500 x even if there's a hundred x you can make a lot of money with titan x so regardless of how many x's it might do you know if you're looking at a thousand you minus that by 99 okay and it does 100x right uh sorry minus that by 90 percent and it does 100x you're still in the money so you turn a, a one thousand dollars into a hundred thousand dollars in this project that's the potential that's the way i look at it and that's why i think you need to be holding at least some uh titan x okay guys a ten thousand dollars or potentially the ten thousand dollars by the time i claim it that i have in uh where, where's the website that I have in Titan X, okay, that could become a million dollars basically with that scenario in mind. Okay, guys, it could be 10 million if it would did a thousand X. Okay, guys, not saying it's gonna do that, not sure if it will do that. Okay, guys, but you know, even if it does a 10x for me, that's a hundred thousand dollars. 10x from here, hundred thousand dollars. I get to claim this in like um, I'm 43% there, okay, guys, so around 50 days or something, no, what, yeah, maybe 50 days or something like that, right, so, yeah, that's what I think about the project, yes, I like it, yes, I'm bullish on it, I'm not talking about it every day like everybody else is, but yes, I did invest in it, and I really do like it, okay, guys, and I see the potential in it, and I'm a high-risk type of guy anyway, so again, it's not financial advice, do your own research, don't risk more than what you can afford to lose, uh, let me know what you think in the comments, 
Titan X. Um, obviously, it's not the most informative video about it. There's plenty of videos out there. And I'm sure you guys know all about it anyway. But that's my take on it. Like, comment, subscribe. Tick the little bell for notifications. Like the video, <clears throat> which helps with the YouTube algorithm. And I'll see you in the very next video. Okay.